So I have about $900 or $895 loss on AMC and Weeble. So in total, I have um, quite a lot of loss. Hey guys, my name is Jacob and welcome to my channel. So I am going to be doing a video today on my investment portfolio as a 20 year old in college. I'm by no means rich or have a lot of money. I definitely don't, but I have worked. I worked uh, since I was like 17 in high school. I've worked like fast food and retail jobs. And so I saved that money and I used that money to invest. And um, I'm definitely excited to show you my portfolio and what I have so far. And yeah, also I want to uh, put a quick disclaimer out there that I am not a financial advisor. I may be in the future, but I'm currently not a financial adv advisor. Um, and so anything I say is for entertainment purposes only. I don't recommend that you guys follow what I'm doing. I'm literally a 20 year, 20 year old in college. Don't copy me because I don't, I don't know what I'm doing to be honest. But yeah, with that said, I'm going to get into the video and show you guys my first account which is on Robinhood. Robinhood actually has a lot of sketchy things going on right now. They're, they're a pretty sketch company in my opinion, but I do have an account with them. It's it's like barely, I don't have too many stocks. I don't have too many like, um, I don't have my money in too many places, but I do have a few stocks in Robinhood. So my Robinhood app should be right here, somewhere right here. Um, and so, yeah. All right, so the first thing I see on the screen is $2,492. That's like the total amount that my account is worth. I have 2.73 shares in Tesla. Currently, this is only what I have in here because when I first bought Tesla, it was right after the split and I wanted to buy more Tesla like four days after I first bought it. I bought it at 3.30, which we'll see in my Weeble account, but then I also bought it like a few days later at 3.60. And honestly, I'm doing really well on Tesla. Um, the other day it was up to like 8.82 or around 8.80. Right now it's at 8.02 and it's also gone down $44 in total today. So that's great. So my current market value for my Tesla shares are $2,193.04 and I have 2.73 shares of it. My average cost for my Tesla, I bought them at 367. I thought it was at like 360, but it was I guess three at 367. Um, and I bought the 2.73 shares on Robinhood about four days after I bought my shares on Weeble. As you can see, I also jumped on the AMC train. So Currently AMC is down, like I'm super down on AMC. I have 52.53 shares in Robinhood of Tesla. Um, I also do have shares in Weeble. At the time of this recording, AMC is currently at $5.70. My current market value with, <laughs> my current market value on AMC is $299.42. So I actually put a, put in a thousand dollars in on my AMC um, investment on Robinhood. So I definitely have lost about seven hundred dollars. So seventy percent of my thousand dollars is gone. So I've lost seven hundred dollars on AMC. But technically, I haven't lost because I don't lose until my I sell my shares. So I, I'm trying to make myself think that. So. Um, AMC is gonna go up. AMC to the moon, baby. No, I'm just kidding. Um, no, I'm not kidding. Definitely go up to the moon. But so that is my AMC holdings in my Robinhood account. Um, my average cost on my Robinhood account for AMC is nineteen dollars and four cents. So I definitely bought at a really high price at the time. It was like nineteen dollars, and everyone was like, "Oh, it's gonna go up. It's gonna go up. It's gonna go up." And me jumping in. I, w I went in, I also thought it was gonna go up. I have had faith that it was gonna go up and it dropped <laughs> days and days after it dropped lower and lower and lower and lower and it did not work out so far. Hopefully it will work out eventually. So yeah, that's my um, Robinhood account so far. I am gonna go into Weeble and show you guys what I have in my Weeble account. All right, so going, going into my Weeble account, my net account value, on Weeble is $5,550 and my total profit and loss is $1,296.35. Um, so that's profit, that's 
how much I made um, with my shares and all my stocks on Weeble. I do have a lot of loss on AMC and Weeble as well. All right, so the first stock I have right here is one share of SWN. I have no idea what that is. It just popped in there this morning after I had a referral. It was a referral bonus. It's worth $4.41 at the time of this video. I also have Naked Brand. Those Naked were for my mom. She wanted to buy some, but she didn't have enough in her account and she had already maxed out her $1,000 limit. So I was like, you know, I'll just buy six of them and see what happens. Right now it's going up. It's been going up. Today was um, up 33% and in after hours it's actually up 13%. So Naked definitely did do a big jump today, but I am still 29 cents down. AMC, so my current average for AMC shares on Weeble is $10.34. Um, I have put in about $2,000 on it and my current value is $1,100. So I have about $900 or $895 loss on AMC and Weeble. So in total, I have um, quite a lot of loss on AMC. I currently have $1,600 in loss on AMC currently. Hoping it goes to the moon because then I can make some money, but I still have faith in it currently. So my next stock I have is NEO. Everyone talks about NEO. I'm super interested in NEO. I actually bought NEO at $45.11. Um, I bought 14 shares and that has gotten me $222 in profits and my current market value with neo is 854 dollars so that is quite a bit for me i haven't been in neo that long i believe it's it's been about a month and a week a month and a week or something like that and i'm definitely down for 222 dollars in gains for a month and a week so um i am currently proud of my investment in neo next up i have chewy so chewy was a very cool investment for me because I was looking up stocks to buy when I first started looking into stocks and getting into investing. I saw Chewy and I was like, all right, that's, I love the idea of Chewy. Like who doesn't want to order their dog food online? Like uh, that's the future of dog food. So my average price on my shares of Chewy would be $55.67. I have a market value of $1,175 and I've gotten $562 in gains on Chewy. So I definitely am proud of that. In total, I spent $612 on Chewy and currently it's worth $1,175. So I've almost doubled my money and that's definitely something cool to say, especially when you barely got into investing. All right, so my first biggest and best investment so far has been Tesla. As I mentioned with my Robinhood, I bought Tesla at $331.63, but I only bought three shares at the time. So in total, I bought $994.88 worth of Tesla. This was right after the split and it had dropped. I think it was like 20%. It was like the biggest drop. And so I was like, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get in. This is when I actually decided I'm gonna get into investing and I wanna learn about it. And so I bought Tesla, I got in on it, and that's how my journey with investing got started. So overall, I've had $1,414.99 profit with Tesla. On Weeble only, I currently have a market value of $2,409.87 on Tesla on Weeble, and my total cost was $994. So I'm definitely like excited about that. I do believe Tesla is like a great company. I do believe they're gonna be able to grow in the long term. And so I did want to keep it as a long-term term stock, but I'm not even sure. I'm like, do I take the profits? Do I not take the profits? So yeah, those are my current investments in Robinhood and Weeble. I do plan on investing more in the future. I do want to get into real estate, but currently that's out of my price range. So it's like, I got to get what I can get, you know? So last year in 2020, I did decide to open a Roth IRA and start saving for retirement. Last year I was like, mm, do I want to save for retirement? Do I want to spend the money? And I decided, you know what? I need to start saving. I was like, the earlier you save, the more money you make. Compounding interest is like your friend when it comes to investing. So I decided I'm gonna invest. I actually went with Vanguard as my brokerage. So Vanguard currently holds my Roth IRA and I will just show you guys real quick what's going on with my Roth IRA. So as of this moment, my current total assets in my Vanguard account 
are $7,393.97. So, so far my return has been $1,392.97. So I did start investing with my Roth IRA when COVID had kind of just started and stocks were plummeting and the stock market was low. So I kind of took advantage of that and I decided to invest. So I actually invested the max you can invest with the Roth IRA per year, which was $6,000. So the actual ticker symbol that I invested in for my index funds was VT Sachs, which is a very popular index fund on Vanguard. So I decided to go with VT Sachs because it's a total stock market index fund. So basically what it means is that you own a tiny, tiny share of stock in pretty much every company that's on the stock market. So that's pretty cool. You could pretty much say you have like tiny, tiny ownership in all of these companies. I'm actually really happy that I did decide to invest in a Roth IRA because I think over time a retirement account is really gonna help me out. So if you guys haven't started or at least thought about starting a retirement account, I would definitely think about it. The younger you start, the more money you'll eventually have as long as you consistently put money in over the years. And compound interest will definitely be your buddy. So start early and get ahead of everyone else. All right guys. So that was basically my complete investment portfolio as a 20 year old in college. Um, I'm actually really proud of my gains and my earnings on my investment portfolio, especially since I don't really know too much what I'm doing. I do do my research, do do my due diligence, but I mean, when you're starting out, you don't really know much and you have to learn a lot. And so it's definitely kind of difficult, but it does pay off. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. I want to do future videos on finance, personal finance, money, business, everything. I do want to do vlogs, random videos. Anything I want to do is going to pretty much be on here. Um, if you guys enjoyed the video, definitely, definitely leave a like, subscribe, as I said, and also leave a comment. Let me know if you guys have started investing, what your portfolio looks like, and what you're proud of. What's, what's your best investment so far in your investment portfolio. Let me know in the comments below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video.